Almost three in four Americans drink a cup of coffee every morning, according to the National Coffee Association, but this popular pick-me-up could be getting more expensive. The worldwide appeal of coffee makes it susceptible to global changes in supply and demand and changes in the climate. Coffee is grown in the coffee belt in the tropics near the equator. The most popular coffee bean, Arabica, is primarily grown in high altitudes in Brazil, but recently these regions have been seeing damaging cold snaps and frost. Recently, coffee reached its highest price in over a decade, according to the International Coffee Organization. The organization reported last month that the average price of coffee per pound was up to $2.37, the highest in 13 years. I wanted to speak to local coffee shops to see how they've been affected. Kaya with Fretboard Coffee says they've noticed changes in their coffee bean supply, but haven't had to raise their prices. We definitely have seen an increase uh, on our end in buying the coffee, but we've tried really hard not to push that onto the consumer. We definitely have seen like a double, uh, we've definitely seen like a 200% increase in our price of coffee since we first started. Kaya noted some possible climate impacts in the areas where they get their coffee beans. It's definitely also a little bit a factor of just the environment changing. I think there's a lot more um, droughts in the areas where we tend to get coffee from and whatnot, and so the distributors don't have as much as they used to all, all the time, and therefore the price of it does go up. She says they've not had to change their price in several years. It's definitely becoming a little bit of an issue, but we've tried really hard to uh, do what we can on our end to, like, quell those costs. An increase in more drought and disasters into the future may still have more impacts on coffee, and people's appetite for coffee is expected to keep growing as well.